Yeah! What up, y'all? Welcome back to another one. Today, this is the first for me. What I mean by first, no, I have went turkey hunting before. I have shot turkeys, but I'm not shooting today. I am filming two other people's hunts today, and y'all requested it. I've been wanting to do it. Today is youth season opener here in Kansas for turkey, and uh, we couldn't have two better shooters. Let me tell you what. Uh, first off, we got my buddy Tristan, his younger brother. That is gonna be a very special one. Um, he said that his brother just gets turned up, uh, gets these crazy adrenaline rushes uh, with the crazy expressions on his face. It is in fact his little brother. It is youth season. And then we got my buddy Troy. We're all gonna be in two blinds next to each other. I hope it works out. We got my buddy Troy, and that is a father-son hunt. They're gonna be right next to us. So if all goes accordingly and to plan, we should have uh, two kids with two turkeys on the ground today. It should be amazing if it all works out. Now, in the last video, the last turkey hunting video, I told y'all, I said, be expecting another turkey hunt, a youth turkey hunt. If it works out, you guys will get it the next day. So. That's what we're doing. We're uploading back-to-back -back days. If you guys like the daily uploads, especially the turkey content, you got to let me know because if you guys like it enough, I will keep cranking it out. I will keep filming people and making these awesome stories for you guys because turkey hunts, every turkey hunt uh, just has its own story. And uh, there's a lot of drama in it. There's a lot of emotion. It's always been my goal to film other people's hunts. You know what I mean? But as you can see, I got the old Ducks Bottomland hoodie on, ready to go. I haven't been up this early in a while. It's been probably a month and a half, almost two months, since I have been up at the butt crack of dawn. Last night, in fact, I was so excited. I woke up at 3 o'clock. It's now 5.15 probably. I woke up at 3 o'clock in the a.m. and just sat in bed on my phone. I couldn't sleep. I've been so excited for today. Turkey season is finally here, y'all. Now, before we get into today's video, uh, one thing. I gotta know something from y'all. Would you guys rather see one of two things from me? Uh, I only get one turkey this season. Now, last year, you could buy two tags for two turkeys. This year, only one tag per person, except for a couple sections in Kansas, which I'm not close to. Would you guys rather see me, here's my question to y'all, would you guys rather see me take a turkey with a bow or a 410? I kind of want to take one with a 12 gauge again so we can use the shot cam. Those three options, let me know down in the comment section, please. I need y'all's help. If you've never dropped a comment and you have a preference, just drop your comment down below and let me know. But I've been rambling for over three minutes. Let's get to the field. Well, <clears throat> I quickly remembered that in turkey hunting, you got to be quiet. So um, between being quiet and the light situation, uh, we probably won't do a lot of filming until the sun comes up. Uh, but we're going to have to interview our two shooters here real soon. I'm not blinding you, am I? What's up, man? Good. <laughs> Good. <laughs> Are you a little nervous to be on the camera? Yeah. That's okay. It's always nervous your first time. Look right here at the camera, not the light. There you go. Tell everybody your name and how old you are. I'm eight years old, and my name is Elijah. Elijah. Who, what's your daddy's name? Troy. Troy, are we hunting buddies? Yes. Yeah, it's time to get you a turkey today. Are you going to get it done? Yep. Oh, yeah. Has he been pretty pumped up? Oh, dude, he's been stoked. Um, the bad thing about having twins is who gets to come first. I mean, <laughs> <laughs> and so uh, last year Graham came first, so this year Eli gets to come first. Oh, so, gotcha. It's a, um, got a nice little setup. Uh, hopefully it all works out for us. Got how many toms are, are here, you think? Uh, Two for sure. There could be four. Gotcha. Um, and a handful of jakes, but we'll see. We only got two to gobble last night off the roost. Gotcha. This is our second shooter of the day. What's up, man? What's up? You're ready to get it done today, aren't you? Yeah. Am I blinding you? Is this too bright? No, it's fine. Okay, okay. Tell everybody your name and your age. My name's Anand, not a city. I'm Donovan, not a city. Um, I like it. I'm hunting because I want to hunt with my big brother. Yep, your big brother take you hunting all the time? Yes, I am. I'm so happy. Right? You're so happy to get here? Yes. <laughs> He's been ready to go, hasn't he? Oh, yeah. He's been bugging you. Oh, He's yeah. He's like, brother, year, let's go. Yep. How many turkeys have you shot? Um, one. One all together, huh? Yes, my friend, um, James shot one. Oh, really? Yeah. He's going to get it done today, I can tell. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. 
All right, buddy, good luck today. I hope we can all Thank get it done. You. Thank you. Well, as you can tell, both shooters are ready. Uh, I'm already having a bunch of fun. This is gonna be really re rewarding. Um, even if they only get one on the ground, this is gonna be a really good time. If you guys like this video so far, you know what to do. Smash the thumbs up button. Give these guys some good luck. Boy, howdy. We are sitting at 6.30. And let me tell you what, that Kansas sunrise is looking beautiful. You comfy right there? Are you good? Yeah. All right, you might have to pick the gun up to shoot the turkey. Okay, yeah. Well, we're all in the blind. Everybody's getting situated. Uh, I really hope, I really hope that we can make it happen here. I hope that you all can hear me. <laughs> oh man, he's going at it. We got a cobbler to the left of us, to the north of us, probably. I bet he's 70, 80 yards away. <laughs> you got a gobbler on the way, dude. Yes. And crazy. This one crazy. Yeah, your brother's pretty crazy. Dude, is it heavy or what? <laughs> here, here, I got it. Oh, that is pretty heavy for you. Dad always has to bring the blankie with him, huh? Yeah. Make sure he ain't over there shivering. Yeah, that's the beauty of the pop-up blind. <laughs> <laughs> right. Keeps you out of the wind at least. Yep, and covers him up. Well, we're out of here. On to the next spot. Uh, Troy and his little boy, uh, he's got to go to work, so they're actually done. But Gerald. Uh, we found that Tom yesterday, Gerald and I, Gerald already has permission on it. We're going to take Tristan and his brother, the ones that I was in the blind with, we're going to take them out east and, and go see if we can get the job done still. It's 8.40, uh, we got about a 20 minute drive, but, but, fingers crossed, hoping that we can still get it done today for Tristan and his little brother. It would be pretty special. And I know Gerald, one thing he has always loved doing for a lot of years now is providing youth hunts. I mean, especially when regular season for us adults is closed. Provide some for the youth, get them out there, help them get a bird on the ground, you know? But I'm having a blast. My nose is running literally all over the place, but on to the next one. Well, pulling up on the next spot here and uh, we're sitting right at 9.09 a.m and we just moved 20 miles northeast from our first location <clears throat> the old beauty local beauties here gerald he's with us and like i said earlier this is the one tom that we got eyes on and that gerald got permission on yesterday in the first turkey scouting prep video that turkey so we're gonna have a heck of a little trot in here probably half mile walk at minimum uh we got the blind to carry and yeah so let's get in there Easy does it now. Watch your back. Watch your back. There you go. Having to cross some fence here. Maybe. Yeah. <laughs> you ready to go still, aren't you? Heck yeah. Oh, heck yeah. Look at all the tracks. Not Gerald's track. Turkey tracks, deer tracks, coon tracks. <laughs> that was awesome. That's awesome. There's gotta be another one. I just kicked the camera on and it was right there. That's a win already. 
Carol, I'm gonna have to whisper. Carol, put eyes on three birds. They're out in the corner of that field right now. Okay. You see, well, that we see one through the gap. Oh, yeah, yeah. What kind of gun you got there anyways? What are you using? Benelli today? Monofeltro. Ooh, a Benelli Monofeltro. Yeah. We got one coming. Well, you want to sit up right here? It's like, hurry, Bobby. <laughs> well, that didn't take long, boys. We threw the blind up real quick. Gerald's on the horn. He's uh, getting one to come, come right at us, so. Well, we're just in here chilling still. We've been in here for probably 10, 15 minutes. Can't quite see much in front of us, so I don't know where the turkeys are or how close they are yet. But it's uh, it's about it's about brunch time, boys. I'm getting hungry out here. Thank goodness. Ho 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 ho. Boy howdy. If Fred knew that I was eating dots without him, he'd be a mad puppy. Ooh, that's one of my favorite ones. You want some, dude? Yeah, I am. There you go. Thanks. Yeah. They're good, dude. Yeah. <laughs> oh. Dude, them pretzels will make anybody excited. <laughs> well, Rambo himself just crawled in here. What's the, what's the report? We got one that's hung up at about 70 to 80 yards right now, but there's two more coming. So hopefully they'll push, push him in. It he's so he's gobbling, he's gobbling every time I call. Have you guys heard him? Oh, we can't hear him over yeah. here. He's, side. every time I call, he's got, I didn't even see him. I was watching the ones over there uh, and he gobbled. He's freaking, oh, from there, he's like 60 yards in front of me. Gotcha. Well, we're moving. We're gonna go chase him. Hold on, hold on. Hey, sit down, sit down. Hold on. It is so windy. Stood up, he was maybe out there 150 yards coming right at us. Well, we're done. And look what Gerald found again. Look at that. Pretty sure. It has to be a matching pair. I think so. Looks like it. So Both what was the first this was the first one you found, because yeah. I remember that. Definitely a matching pair. Man, he was he was hard at it, dude. Yeah. And then look at this. Hold that up. I have to block the wind with my body. That's an old one. Yeah, that is an old one. Yep. Sure is, but heck of a fine, dude. I'll take it. Sorry for the wind. We're already three quarter of the way into this section and we we're parked on the north side. I just took the other two guys and we kept going south only a quarter mile. Gerald trucked the three quarter mile back north and came and picked us up. So along the way, he got some good finds. That's awesome. Some success today. That's good. Come on, Frederick. Let's go, buddy. Come on. Well, we're back home, and uh, it's a few days later. It's actually the day after opening day archery for adults. Whoop! And let me tell you what. If you guys follow me on Instagram, you would have seen on my story, I may or may not have got it done opening day of archery. That video will be the next video going up indeed. I don't know if I'm gonna post it tomorrow or the next day, but the next video that goes up, it's a banger. But my goodness, on this hunt, it was so windy. That, that was partially the main problem, just so windy. The birds couldn't hear us, we couldn't hear them very well. On the first set, we got them within maybe 70, 80 yards. They just didn't want anything to do with it. That They never even really came to look at it. They just got out of the roost and went the opposite way pretty much. On the second set, we got really, really close. I wasn't able to film it, but we got that bird within probably, I bet he came to 40 yards and he was behind an evergreen. If he would have came to the side and around that evergreen another 10 yards, Andre would have smoked him. Andre was pretty pumped up. They're still trying to get him a bird. Uh, it's probably, what, four days later now, so. Turkey hunting has not been easy, let me tell you what. 
But if you guys like these turkey videos, if you guys like the videos of me videoing other people's hunts, I really want to do more of them. As a lot of you have seen recently, I got a big lens, which I didn't have on this hunt. So if you guys, like I said, if you want to see more turkey hunts of me filming other people's turkey hunts, that is, with the big old juicy lens, drop a comment down below and let me know. Turkey season's only around for so long, you know. Let me know your guys' thoughts. Uh, be sure to subscribe if you haven't, that's for certain. And if you're not a Ducks T-shirt of the month subscriber, check this bad boy out. This is April's T-shirt of the month. The Ducks T-shirt of the month is only $14.99 a month and you get a one-off Ducks T-shirt in your mailbox every single month. And these T-shirts are one-off. Only you Ducks T-shirt of the month subscribers get these shirts. You can't just go online and buy them. But again, thank y'all for being here. Big shout out to my notification gang. Y'all know it. Hit the little bell if you haven't. It'll notify you when I upload, y'all. But I hope you guys are getting out there this turkey season. Believe me, when I say it's only around for a limited amount of time, it's only a month long, if that. But until next time. Fred. Peace. I've been getting laid back, baby. You should know that I don't need your criticism, pessimism. I've been keeping it on the DL. Got a girl.